Hello there, episode two of, I guess, recovery vlogs and stuff that I'm doing here. Pretty exciting day. Um, I was just sitting here. Malcolm, who's right there with my mom, uh, heard a noise over by the door, apparently delivery man. I thought, like, I just ordered a book. Maybe it's the book. Apparently something a little more crazy. They give for you this thing. I open up the box and I see this. It's this tall stack of uh, whatever this is. Let's read the card here if I can get it. I should be able to. Right here. I'm using. I'm doing this one-handed because it's crippled. But Max, this says it's a Father's Day cheese tower. But well, we think it's more of a get well soon sort of tower because cheese. Feel better. Feel better. Team 3BD. Thanks, guys. Thanks so much. Team 3BD, I should explain, is the the company that I work with. They help, you know, kind of bring branded deals to me. They help represent me, and they're awesome, cool people. They're people that I was hanging out with in South by Southwest. You saw that from part one of that vlog. Obviously, I still have to edit part two. I will. But they sent me a giant thing of cheese, I guess. Cheese? <laughs> I did not expect this at all. It's got a nice little ribbon on it and everything, so I guess we can just try to try to dive on in to this, I don't really, this is where I may need your help. You know what, okay, you got it. Never mind, I'm good. You got it. First box, watch it be like something inappropriate. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Roca, almond Roca. I don't know what that's about. I'm just gonna get really good at doing this kind of stuff one-handed. Nailed it. Hey, wasabi peas it looks like. Nice. What is that? Ooh. I don't know what that is, but that looks good. Malcolm's Probably interested too. Probably cherry candy. Malcolm's like, ooh, what is that? Ooh, these are what's, good. Look at that. What's that? What is that, Malcolm? Jellies. What is that? He's like, I don't know, but I could smell it through the bag. But it smells great. The boxes keep getting bigger, which is a little alarming and also exciting at the same time. We got, ooh. ooh. So this is not just cheese. This is like just like delectable snacks kind of thing. Almonds. Got some almonds there. Get close up of that. Really good with chocolate. Maybe chocolate covered cherries or something? No, more like a malt know. ball, I think. Malt ball? Can't tell. Very awesome cool. stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Got like a. What do they call that? That kind of mix? Kind of a. I don't know. Spicy nut and. Yeah, like, it looks like it's a spicy Like a mix pub mix kind of thing? Yeah. That and looks good. Crackers, but what do you put on crackers? Probably cheese. Could Mom, be. Garlic roasted and rosemary crackers. All right. Nice. Here we go. Ooh. Wow. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Pretzels. We have some pretzels. It just says pretzels. Okay. I thought maybe there was like some, some special. White cheddar popcorn. White cheddar popcorn and then cheese. Cheese. Look at that. It's Wisconsin, Wisconsin cheddar. Wisconsin cheddar. Wisconsin, More Wisconsin. cheddar. I think they're all Wisconsin cheddar. And da da da. Wisconsin cheddar. Very cool. Very, Very nice. Very cool. Thank you to whoever, uh, the, who's behind this. I have an idea of who's behind this. Hillary, if it's you, thank you very much. Um, thank you to everybody at 3BD. Uh, super awesome working with those guys. I don't really talk about 3BD too much, but they're, they're a really cool company that I work with. And they sent me a giant thing of a bunch of snacks. So thank you guys so much. Not necessary, but a great start to the day. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to share these snacks with, with my mom and definitely not Malcolm because Malcolm would have horrible gas if he ingested any of this stuff. But good, good start to the day. Upon further inspection of the packaging that I had, there was another box there. Um, a gift from Hillary. I confirmed this is from Hillary from 3 Black Dot uh, because she calls me Maximilius Rex. With great power comes great responsibility. Use your winter soldier clavicle wisely and get well soon. P.S. By do dinosaur, they mean Maximus Rex's. P.P.S. Momo the monkey is just creepy enough. This is Momo the monkey that also came with. And look, his sling is on the proper arm as well. I read his little tag and he crashed into a tree apparently, but he's like a little get well friend, a little get well stuffed animal. I like how sassy this dinosaur is. He's like got his arms crossed. I'll open this up real quick. Look at them, they're all thick. Thank you very much, Hillary. I also realized I haven't really given you guys an update um, on like, you know, surgery stuff and how I'm feeling. So we are four days out from surgery. I had surgery on Monday and it is now Thursday. Um, much better. Still a little bit of pain. I'm still on pain meds, not taking as much. I was taking about two a day and now I'm taking about one a day, sometimes two if it's later in the day and you know, or if it's I'm particularly achy. Um, but the pain is a lot more manageable even when I am off the meds. 
Um, still in a sling. We got about maybe three more days or so about being in a sling or, or for being in a sling. And then afterwards it comes off. I can still take the sling off like now and move my elbow around and arm around. They encourage that just to keep, you know, mobility and stuff from getting too stiff, keep the muscles moving and stuff and working. But that's what's going on uh, with me. Doing better, doing good. We're still, I mean, like four days out from, from having surgery and I'm still feeling pretty good. Um, actually, later today, uh, I think we're gonna be going to check out the Razor unveiling of their, their first store ever in a little preview event in San Francisco at Westfield Mall, I believe that's where it's at. But um, I was invited and it's the first Razor store ever. So super cool guys at Razor. Shout out to Josh, Josh Collins or Shihua. I think, how do you say your name, Josh? I'm, I don't even know, Shihua? Shihua? It's got three H's after an S and then UA. So Shihua, I think that's how your name is. But Josh, super awesome and everybody at Razor, super, super cool. So we're gonna go do that and that's kind of what I have planned yet for the rest of the day. Um, surgery update though, doing okay hanging in there and healing. And extra shot of Malcolm because everybody says he needs to be in videos more, so here he is. Hi Malcolm, people like you. I don't know why. Hey, what's up? Now we are in Eric's car. Hi Eric, I didn't ask you if you wanted to be on camera, but he's <laughs> just on camera now. We're going into the city to check out the Razor store. The first Razor store ever uh, it's launching in San Francisco. Is it in the Westfield Mall? Uh... It should be neat. Um, Josh and those guys, I'm friends with all of them. So they were kind enough to give me uh, an invite. They were going to invite me in general when I hit them up. He said, you know, I was going to throw you an invite, but I saw you had an accident. So I thought maybe you were out of commission. Broken bones don't stop me. <laughs> Whatever. I'm, 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 a, I'm cyborg, max. cyborg max now. I'm Cymax now. I got metal in my, my, my arm. And I can't talk, apparently. No, metal uh, is intercepting <laughs> your speech. Exactly. Your I was joking on stream, too. Like, you watch Friends? Yeah. Uh, you know how like Raw or uh, Chandler gets his nubbin removed, uh -huh. and at the end of the episode, he's like, he misses an obvious joke or something. He's like, the source of all my power. <laughs> like, what if like you know my bone, my cl my clavicle, <laughs> my clavicle was, was somehow my ability to like be entertaining or whatever. <laughs> but let's be honest, I've never been entertaining. You all know this. You all know this. Why are you watching this video? Anyways, uh, on our way into the city, should be fun times. <laughs> Here. We made it. We did it. We made it to the city, Eric. We did it. Stupid and drivers, though. Stupid. Only died, what, like three times? We're somewhere in the mall now. We saw the little thing. It's definitely here. I don't know where, but it's definitely here. Somewhere. We will find the Razor store. It better be fucking impressive. Just saying, if it's not, Josh, I'm gonna cry on all your laptops and fry them. What up? The Razor store. That's it. Amazing. We're here. Look all around you. We did it. Crazy. What's your favorite part about it? Uh, Be careful now. You work for the company. That we actually have one here now. Yeah. That's, not a, that's not a part he, of the he story. Never, he never, he never gives good answers. He's easily going to win there and just be like, I'm staring at him. No, he teed it up Look for it. you. He had it. He had the right answer. Well, Come that's on. why they pay him more than me. Yeah. <laughs> Like this, it's lying. nice. Little <laughs> I know, right? Team Racer, Fort Gamers, Spy yeah, Gamers. Yeah, give you the cute jacket. <laughs> oh. He's got a nice shirt. Yeah, and he's kind of, he's kind of got a shirt. I, I got the hat. I'm, I, it's not a I'm horrible. Moving it, I'm moving it up right here. Yeah, I want to make sure that this uh, focus stays on the money maker. That's, there you go. Uh, <laughs> that's what it's all about. We're here. I don't know if I'm in frame or not. I could flimp this around. I'm still crippled. They're going to show me all the cool stuff that Razor has. I don't know why I'm laughing. <laughs> it's like a it's weird, like, nervous it's like, first day. It's like, like, yeah. like, I'm really excited to be here, guys. <laughs> no, uh, we're at the Razor store. It's in the Westfield Mall. Check it out. It opens Saturday. So it'll be, it'll be open probably by the time this vlog goes up because I don't edit things very quickly. I take my time. I'm sweaty from walking here. There's a good little spread right there of like little little finger stuff, little finger foods. Um, I'm gonna look at that beautiful B-roll.
things. I, t I took all their hardware. That's why all they have left is just this TV behind me. Um, hey, thanks for at least coming yeah. us with the TV. Appreciate yeah. that. You guys want something? Yeah. I figured leave you with something. That's Pretty good. good. We're gonna go eat now. Uh, make sure that his arm is growing properly and not super weirdly. I have to grab something. He's helpful. How many napkins did you she get? She said hang me a bunch of napkins. That was a, but that was like an inappropriate amount of napkins. That was like 12 napkins. Something, something could have spilled? Something? I don't know. You know as much information as I do. I don't know. I think that's an important thing I to found, explore. I found the secrets of vlogging is don't do so much yourself. Let everybody else make the content. And then you just get to kind of every now and then throw your face in there. Remember, hey, it's my channel. Hey. Uh -huh. Hey, in the comments. There you go. See? Uh, when someone like, asks you to pass a napkin, what's the appropriate number to pass them? Don't forget to Where like, it's just like, wow, like, you really gave me way too many napkins. And tell us how wrong he is about his uh, napkin choices. Like two napkins. It's appropriate. What's the appropriate number of napkins how to give somebody? How many is a bunch? How many is a bunch? What about a grip? 15. I'm going with 15. I mean, just, just overcompensate, you know? Right. Kill trees. Bring it in. Come in. Bring, give me a hug. Don't touch him. He's in. Give me an awkward hug. Thanks, guys. And now we're uh, we're going to go to P.F. Chang's. And I'm wearing... I said I kind of look like a, like a Bond villain or something. I don't know why I felt like that. But I feel like always is like the evil guy's always got like a sling on. Because he's like been in some shit in movies. But whatever. I'm wearing uh, Eric's very nice Kenneth Cole jacket. Ooh. Fancy. Eric has a job at Twitch. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, he does. That means you get Kenneth Cole jackets galore. <laughs> it's one of the perks of being a Twitch employee. Now we're gonna go to PF Chang's, meet up with uh, with our buddy Jesse, and then my mother is also gonna meet us. Good times. Hey, what's up? I'm kind of intercutting footage here because it's a different day than the last stuff that you saw. And initially, I was gonna try to. Um, upload a vlog every single day, you know, of like the recovery process, um, but that seemed unrealistic as I was trying to do it and my arm was less functioning than I thought it was uh, being and pain and stuff like that, so it would have just been frustrating. So here is another update and also I have some other stuff to mention that's coming up that I'm going to be doing. Um, I don't know what day it is far, as far as um, out, how far out from surgery. I think a little over a week now from surgery. I had surgery last Monday, this last p past Monday. And today is, what day is today? Today's Monday. So yeah, it's been about a week, an exact about a week uh, since I had surgery. Arm mobility pretty good. You know, this is the, this is the arm that had operation on it. I still have the bandage on. Um, it's still kind of annoying and itchy and whatever, but I've been dealing with it. Um, I'm looking forward to getting it off. The bandage comes off tomorrow on Tuesday. That's my follow-up appointment uh, where they're going to take out the sutures or whatever they got going on to, to hold me together um, after surgery. And uh, I also will hear probably if I have to do any sort of like rehabilitation or like, you know, arm strengthening and stuff like that. <clears throat> so that'll be good. I'm just super excited to be back kind of more to normalcy. I'm already feeling more normal. Uh, as far, it's not in the sling anymore. It, the sling technically is supposed to come off tomorrow, but they said I can have the sling off, you know, like when I'm, when I feel like having it off and whatever. And I've just been kind of, it, it feels like I can have it off and move it around a bit. And I haven't been, I haven't been overdoing it. I don't want you guys to think I have. So I will be at Insomnia, Ireland. I'm going to be going to Ireland June uh, 10th through the 13th, I believe. And it's in Killarney. Killarney, Ireland. Um, I've never been to Ireland before. So super, super exciting for me. Uh, I'm going to be, of course, vlogging and taking footage and I'm excited to meet any of you guys that may go. Um, tickets are still on sale if you guys want to. All of that information is going to be in the description of this video. Please do go, you know, go check it out. See if it's something you want to do. This is the first time they're doing this event in Ireland. Insomnia puts on all sorts of events throughout the year. Uh, mainly they're in, in Birmingham. In England, I went to Insomnia 56 and I'm probably going to be going to Insomnia 58. I believe that is also in the books for me to go to. But I will be at Insomnia Ireland along with Terrorizer, uh, Brian the Gaming Terrorizer, which I'm sure many of you guys know. But I'll be there, he'll be there. I'm not really sure who else is going to be there. Maybe check on the website, uh, again, below in the guest list to see who else is going to be there. But tickets are still available if you guys want to go there and potentially meet me. I'll be doing stuff. I'll be doing on stage stuff and signings and all the fun things like that. So if you want to go to Ireland or you're in Ireland or you're in the surrounding area, and it's not too hard of you, hard, hard of you. It's not too hard for you to get there. Feel free to. I'll be there. And maybe get some tickets. And maybe I'll see your face. And we'll hug. 
and you'll politely ask if you can touch my beard, and I'll say, probably. Yeah, I'll say yes. Uh, this kind of wraps up this vlog. It's kind of a mishmash of a bunch of different footage um, because I didn't really have a plan, and I think that's part of the thing with vlogging, too, is just you have, like, an idea of what you want, but you always end up kind of with, like, a bastardized version of <laughs> what you wanted. And for me, a little bit different in this case because I didn't actually, I, like, physically was not up to editing this stuff and, you know, moving my computer around and all that because I had my electronics everywhere. Anyways, this wraps up the vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, you see more in the future and more content, more normal content coming very soon because... My arm is now available, uh, available? I don't, what, this is such a weird word choiceage. Choiceage? What the fuck is happening? Weird word choice. Anyways, this vlog's done. I'm, I'm losing the ability to speak, so let's wrap it up. But I was saying, more gaming content, more normal content, because now my arm is actually, like, mobile enough I can play on the computer and do stuff like I used to be able to do. So, yeah, that's it. You guys, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time, okay? <laughs>